everybody, it's Amanda and it is time to make a smoothie. Of course, this is our Frugal Family Food Summertime Treat Series and on Saturdays we're making smoothies and uh, it's Friday for me actually and I'm going to show you how I make a vegan smoothie and you can make it non-vegan if you prefer and the difference is this, tofu. I'm going to use this silken tofu and you can choose to use Greek yogurt if you would prefer, but I'm gonna use my silken tofu. It is non-GMO verified USDA organic, guys. Tofu is not the enemy, it's your friend. So, we're gonna use that. I have my food processor all set up back here. Let me tell you what else we have besides tofu. We have blueberries. I'm making berries all week. I got a bunch of them, I'm just gonna use them all up. I have strawberries. These are frozen sliced strawberries that I froze myself. I have spinach. I have almond milk. I have almonds. Now, I would have preferred to put in walnuts, but I was out. So I'm going to use almonds. You can use whatever nut you like. I'm going to use some flax seed. You can use any other added that you want. You can use some hemp seed, maybe some chia seeds, but. I have flaxseed meal and that's what I'm gonna use. And that's it, it's gonna be really, really tasty. So let me show you what it looks like as we put it in the food processor. So we're gonna add one cup of blueberries and then we are going to add one cup of strawberries. Now I'm using frozen berries, but you can also use fresh berries. It's gonna be a little bit thicker consistency if you're using the frozen because of that iciness. Uh, but either one works just fine. Then you're going to add one cup of almond milk. Again, you have some options here. You could use cow's milk, rice milk, soy milk, any milk that you feel comfortable with. You could even add water if you prefer. Then we're going to add half a cup of spinach. I'm just going to toss a couple of handfuls in here. And we're going to add a quarter of a cup of almonds. Uh, again, a couple of handfuls and we'll be done with that. One tablespoon of the flax meal. Again, you can use uh, chia seed or hemp seed. And here's our silken tofu. You're going to want one-fifth of a block. And to figure that out, you're going to cut it in half with your knife and then half again. And then move a little bit over and that should give you your one-fifth measure approximately. And go ahead and toss that in. Then we're going to put the lid on and uh, process that until it's nice and smooth. Now you want to make sure when you get about halfway through, go ahead and uh, take a spoon and scoop those sides down, get everything clear and process it one more time. Then what I want you to do is go ahead and stick your finger in and taste it just to make sure it's the right uh, sweetness for you. I needed some sugar so I added about two tablespoons of my Demera sugar. Then go ahead and put the lid on and process it one more time just to make sure everything is incorporated. When you're done, check for sweetness again, and this time it's perfect. Hey okay guys, that's it. Super simple in my little jar. I have enough for this jar, uh, which is I guess a 16 ounce jar, and then I have enough for probably another half jar. So this is perfect for you and maybe one of the kids. It's really good. You're really mostly tasting the berry. And uh, frankly, I think the flax seed adds a little something extra to it, but it's really, really good. And I hope you guys are taking advantage of all those berries that you're getting on sale right now. So go get yourself a smoothie. I'm gonna take another sip because it's really good. And make yourself one today. You're gonna love it. Your kids are gonna love it. You're gonna be super healthy. So that's it for today. You guys come back tomorrow. Tangie's gonna be making a peach trifle in mason jars. So you guys are gonna, gonna wanna take part in that. And all the guys are here waiting for their sip. So see you guys later. Bye. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm really glad you came to visit us here at the Fundamental Home. Make sure if you enjoyed this video that you click the like button and also click subscribe right below me for more videos coming into your inbox all the time. And also, if you enjoy social media, we've got links up at the top here for Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, all the other fun things. And check out thefundamentalhome.com for more information about what we're doing all the time and how we do it, because there's way more details there. And uh, here, over to the right, we have some videos that I recommend. So thanks again for coming by, and we'll see you next time. Bye!